Okay, folks. So, just got done taking uh, this Willie King Brutus through the uh, mud. There's caked all up in there. Sorry about the wind. It's kind of windy out here, so apologize if uh, that's cutting into the sound. Basically, I'm just going to show you how I go about cleaning my trucks after the mudding. Um, I left the battery in there just because I don't feel like digging it out. But if you can, just pull out your battery. Obviously, if you want, it's waterproof everything. Um, do that ahead of time because it certainly can uh, ruin electronics. Uh, if you guys see in here, I didn't I didn't waterproof anything. It's just all exposed. So um, gonna hose it off. Show you kind of just what I do. You could use your regular hose, just the hose itself, or you can get a sprayer. Put it on a shower setting. Um, could get brushes. Scrub it out. You could scrub out the uh, tight spots with the toothbrush. But let's go ahead and. Uh, Hose it all down and then kind of see what we have left. I'm not going crazy, it's just on the shower setting. Just enough to get that mud off. Get it off the dry shaft, the cage, the body. Now if you've been letting it sit for a minute, you probably then want to get that toothbrush and go inside. This is right after I was done mudding, so nothing should be dried yet, but that's it. Hose it down, uh, dry it off with a towel, or if you got compressed air, maybe blow it off. Um, pretty easy, pretty simple. Let me grab the controller, controller transmitter, show you that it still moves and runs. Steering. So you can see with no waterproofing, leaving the battery in while I did it, not a big deal. Not recommended, but it's possible. So, thank you for watching. Please uh, hit the subscribe button. Uh, I'll leave this mudding video of the Brutus truck in the description below, or maybe I'll put it up here somewhere too. But go check that out. Uh, share the videos, and thank you for watching. Catch you guys next time.